chance, no way, I won't say I'm in love. Hello everybody, hello hunties, and also the darlings and the divas. How are we all doing? Hopefully we're all doing well, hopefully you're treating yourselves well, mentally and physically please. Um, don't know why I went off on that one, but anyway, we're here, we're sitting down for more Game of Thrones. Sorry once again, I, I feel like a broken record at this point. I'm sorry that this is taking so long, all right? I had to take a few days off, um, but I wasn't off because I was working on something very special that should be coming very soon, hopefully, right? But it's fun. And I'm excited, and most of you already know about it. But anyway, um, so we're here to sit down for two more episodes of Game of Thrones. We've got two today, and then there'll be another two coming relatively soon, I'd imagine. Um, although I say that, I'm going to be dog-sitting next week. So it'll come as soon as I possibly can, right? But with that said, I don't want to chat too long because I'm very excited to get into this. I want us to find the dragons. Um, some of you guys have told me that the rest of season two is pretty stressful, traumatic. Um, and to that I say yay. <laughs> um, let's get into the video. Check me out on Instagram, it'll be up on the screen there. Check me out on Spotify, Twitter, Patreon, Discord, and TikTok, all linked down below. Thanks to my appraisers and patrons, thanks for being over there, thanks for finding the channel. The audio version of this will go up on Patreon before you see it on YouTube. So, if you want to see the whole unedited episodes up to now, then check out the Patreon, everything's up there. All the movies that I do, everything, they all go up there before they come up on YouTube. And it typically is a few days before, especially for the Game of Thrones. So if you want to be the first ones to see it, and it's like we're besties watching it together, then go and check it out, it's three pounds. It'll be linked down below. And yeah, let's do this. Guys, I'm well excited. I've got a, I've got a really fun video that I'm filming later. So you're gonna be getting some good, good, good things. Anyway, woo, bye. Bye. Hello. <laughs> oh my dear. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. I'm 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 quite panicked about the dinosaurs. Uh, not dinosaurs. Dragons. <laughs> I'm so excited, but also scared. Because who's got the dragons? <laughs> that was creepy. Oh, he's going to wake up and see that she's not there because she's escaped. Woo. I love it and I also support it. Let a cripple escape. The giant must have took him. The giant? I'm gonna say he's hardly a giant. Hodor's hardly a giant, he's just a tall man. By those standards, I'm a fucking giant. And we're gone too, the little one. Gone, along with a wildling woman. Slay! The one you were fucking. The whole hallway <laughs> smells like cum. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, you were getting your end away. <laughs> that was a pathetic punch, I'm sorry. How do you go like that? Okay, I think you've proved your point, you pussy boy. I don't like him. Get the horses and the hounds. Shit. Shit. Enjoying your first hunt? So far, hunting seems very similar to riding, my lord. With hunting, there's blood at the end. Wait, you're gonna kill it? It's gonna kill them? You're gonna kill them? If I find them soon enough, I won't hurt them. No. Well, I'll hurt them, but I won't kill them. What an awful human being. See, they've got wolves. I wonder how many how many people wolves can tackle at once, because... I know that farm. They'll give us some food. We can't risk it. They'll be after us with hounds. Okay, at least we're, at least we're aware and we're not being naive to think that we're like, Completely out of harm's way. Love that. These two I've got no fucking time for it. And I think you guys like her from what I was seeing in some of the comments. But this whole situation just pissed me off. Just do what's right, for, like, straight away. Did you pull a knife on me in the night? <laughs> what's the matter? Can't be the first time you press your bone against a woman's ass. I mean, a man can't help that, right? A man cannot help an erection. Okay? You're a boy who's never been with a girl. Is he a f I kind of want him to be a f 
Don't your stones start to hurt if your ball forgets them? Don't call them that. But stones. Yeah, shut up. Shut your mouth. <laughs> Dirty. Dirty. Egret. Awful name. Who who chooses that name for a child? I heard they get all swollen and bruised if you don't use them. Well, that's a lie. I should know. <laughs> there are no women of the Night's Watch, no. So the lads just do it with each other? N I'd be on board. So instead of getting naked with a girl, you prefer to invade our land? Invade your land! I don't understand why it matters. Do you know what I mean? Wildlings raid our lands all the time. Some of them try to kill my little brother, a crippled boy. They're not your lands. We've been here the whole time. You lot came along and just put up a big wall and said it was yours. Oh, that's why we're pissed off. Okay. I have the blood of the first men. My ancestors lived here, same as yours. So why are you fighting us? There's a, there's a lot of tension here, a lot of pent up anger here, and I'm quite confused. Like, what's. I don't understand what our goal is. Like, is, it, is our goal to take her back with us? Because they said that, they, that like, we weren't able to do that. Is that mutton? Don't like mutton. I'll bring something else. Leave it. God, it's piping hot. Look at it. Fucking hell. You hungry? Well, no fucking shit. Of course she's fucking hungry. She's starving. Sit. He's letting her eat. Eat. I tell you what, for such a despicable man, he's not... He's not treating her too nastily currently. But I guess he doesn't know that she's a Stark. I'm sure if he knew she was a Stark, things would really change swift. The Great Hall had 35 hearths. Look at it now. A blasted ruin. Do you know what happened? Dragons? Yes. Dragons happened. Oh, and they'll be happening again soon. I what? Aegon Targaryen changed the rules. That's why every child alive still knows his name. Now that is a legacy. Aegon and his sisters. Student of history, are you? Senya Targaryen was a great warrior. She had a Valyrian steel sword she called Dark Sister. God, I would, I would have loved to have seen it. I really would have. It sounds like such a slay time to be alive. Dragons and people with souls and powerful women. You remind me of my daughter. That's, that's not a compliment, is it? Can't say I've ever met a literate stonemason. Have you met many stonemasons, my lord? Shade! Careful now, girl. I enjoy you, but be careful. Oh, God, yeah, it's, it's tiptoeing. It's tiptoeing on eggshells, isn't it, around this situation? Girl. No born girls say, my lord. If you're going to pose as a commoner, you should do it properly. My mother served Lady Dustin for many years, my lord. She taught me how to speak proper, properly. You're too smart for your own good. Oh, this is getting tense. I'm tense. I'm tense. Guys, I feel like it's only a matter of time till he susses her out. But I mean, I tell you what, she is witty. I'll give it her. I told, I told this last instalment, she knows how to use a gal. Does it give you joy to scare people? No, it gives me joy to kill people. Oh, yikes. Killing's the sweetest thing there is. Why are you always so hateful? You'll be glad of the hateful things I do someday when you're queen. Oh, I hope... I mean, I hope she's queen, but I hope she's never queen to Joffrey. I've demanded a meeting of the Thirteen. One of them did this or knows who did. We will get them back. We better get them back. Khaleesi, many times in my life, I have been... I don't care where you've been. All I care about is getting my dragons back. Now. Peronto, hunty. For fuck's sake, we don't want to marry you either. We're a powerful, strong, independent woman. Thank you very much. Do you know what? I live for Jon Snow, but this situation, I'm so over it. But I suppose this is us getting to know the wildlings, right? And actually what they're about and what they stand for. We chose Mance Raider to lead us. He was a crow, same as you. But he wanted to be free. Good for him, I guess. I guess. Well, you could be free too. You don't need to live your whole life taking commands from old men. I mean, to be honest, I am about that. I, I am I am about a free life. Like, the, 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 the Night's Watch is not the life for me. So I do agree with her. You're a pretty lad. Girls would claw each other's eyes out to get naked with you. I'd be there too. <laughs> I could teach you how to do it. I know how to do it. 
You just gotta find the right hole. <laughs> and give it a rub while you're at it. Do you know what I mean? Can't go wrong. Your Grace. A minute of your time. Ooh, she's back. What's her name? Tatiana or something? No, it's um uh, Talisa! Cost N dubs. I've already run through the supplies I brought with me. You're riding to the crag to negotiate a surrender. Yes. The crag will have a Meister, and he will have what I need. Come with me to the crag. Let the Meister show you his stores. I want the wounded men to be treated well. She'll like that. She'll like that because she had a prop. She had a. That was her main issue to begin with, wasn't it? That like, it, like these men were getting hurt because of like essentially him and this war. So it's it's. Uh, I see what he's doing. He's work. He's working it. Rob is working. Where are they? Who will us? The Stark boys, where are they? Don't know, I see no one. Oh! I hate him! I hate him! My lord, I think I found what we're looking for. What was that? What was that? Was it the walnut, walnut shell? What do you think they'll say when they hear about you and me? Nothing happened between you and me. I was all out in the open, all angry as you like, and I didn't want to want it, but oh, I did. And he spread me legs and ruined. <laughs> he can spread my legs and ruin if he wants. <laughs> since it's going to be your word against mine, and since you can't talk about it without blushing, you may as well, Joes. She's horny for it, isn't she? She's a horn dog. Are you that afraid of it? What do you not understand that he took an oath, darling? Well, it's nice and wet. And wet? Ugh. Can we calm down? God's your doll. Hunted. <laughs> I'm going to say, yeah, she, she's. She, uh, in my mind, she was double crossing him, absolutely. Because I think if anything's evident in this show, is like it, to get around a man and to like. Make make him like lower his guard. It's appeal to his horny and boner side, isn't it? <laughs> Fab, Fabo, fabulous. No. Oh, she's had a period. Fuck. <laughs> that me that means she's ready to have babies. Oh, Lord. If the Queen sees, I can have Joffrey's children now. Help me flip it over. Yeah, come on. We can't be having that. We don't need more his babies in the world. Hey. Oh, and she's seen, and she's going to go grassing, of course, because she's not a friend of ours. Not on my watch. Where are you going? To tell her grace. Exactly. You'll say nothing to anyone. Honestly, work. <laughs> exactly. Watch yourself, ho. Oh, fuck something. The hound seen it. Bollocks! Your mother might have prepared you. Oh, for fuck's sake. I don't want this. You're a woman now. Do you have any idea what that means? I'm fit to bear children for the king. A prospect that once delighted you. The greatest honor. For a queen. Uh, I can't handle this stupid way of thinking. Joffrey's always been difficult. And that's your fault! I love his grace with all my heart. That's so very touching to hear. It's also a lie, but good for you, Sansa. You keep lying, darling. You keep lying. Love no one but your children. On that front, a mother has no choice. Well, that's chill. She's lying, so it's fine. But shouldn't I love Joffrey, your grace? You can try. God, so she don't, she don't even need her to pretend to be like in into this whole scenario because realistically, like she wasn't like her her king and her husband wasn't what she envisioned for her life. So I guess it makes sense. I squired for you once, you know. Well, when I think back to that day, thank you, because I was not interested in what they had to say. <laughs> you were saying? Oh. That was the best day of my life. God, how sad. How sad.
Nothing new, nothing changed, same old shit. Same old fuck. Without me, the dragons will die. It will be for the best. Oh, piss off! Uh, I want to see some winged beasts. The mother of dragons is in the right. I will help you, Khaleesi. See, I thought it might have been him, the warlock. I will take you to the house of the undying, where I have put them. Huh? You have my dragons. Wait, I was right. <laughs> I made an arrangement with the king of Karth. What? He procured them for me. But there is no king of Karth. There is now. Bitch, what the f That was the other half of the arrangement. So he has the dragons. Well, let's go. The mother of dragons will be with her babies. Oh, amazing. Then why did you take them in the first place? She will give them her love, and they will thrive by her side. Okay, amazing, but why did you take them? I'm so, I'm so confused why they... Forever. <laughs> oh my god, he's, he's killed the 13! Oh dear god! He's killed the 13! Well, I guess now there's only two. He's killed the 11. The dragons wait for you in the house of the undying. Come see them. Wait, is he wanting to kill her? So she can go to the house of the undying? I'm so confused. What the actual fucking god? I caught the Kingslayer. Oh, we've got him back. Oh, we've got him back. Yay. Sometimes I wonder. What? If this is the price for what we've done. Huh. For our sins. Yeah, I think it is. I believe in that. You've beaten the odds. Tommen and Marcella are good, decent children, both of them. Joffrey's really not, though. Like, Joffrey's enough to really tip the scales the other way. Do you know what I mean? Two decent children and Joffrey, I'm afraid it's... Like, he's he is one fucked up young boy. He really is so fucked. And I mean, it's, it's actually nice to see that she is, she is somewhat sad about it and is like actually confronting that she necessarily didn't do the best it's interesting where did you find this beast don't fucking insult brienne she is a truer knight than you will ever be yes she fucking is Your sword I told you what would happen if you served me loyally. And what would happen if you did not? You still question whether your new lord means what he says. Here is the answer to your question. Oh. What? What? Do not even... <laughs> it's disgusting. What? <laughs> What the actual fuck? The woman was too stunned to speak. Was that Bran and the younger one? What? Surely not. Un no, I'm not believing it until I I know for sure because I feel like don't believe anything until you see it happen. Do you know what I mean? It's weird that like we've just seen the bodies. We've not seen them actually get burned and he also looks shocked. Why did Tyrion why did Theon look shocked? Like he didn't expect them to be burned. Guys, if that's Bran I'm thinking, what? Anyway, I suppose let's continue on to the next episode because I need some clarification. All right? <sighs> All right. Oh my God, these socks are a mess. Look at this. I need clarification as to what's going on here. Why, it's the Prince of Winterfell. I saw the bodies above your gates. Which one gave you the tougher fight, the cripple or the six-year-old? Oh my god, they're so... so oh. No! You treated them with honor. 
by butchering them. Before I had to kill them, you I treat Wait, no, I don't think he's killed them. I think this is a way of him getting people on his side. Cause I'm a mastermind. Yeah, it's his way of like making people fall in line. That's what I think. Cause we've not seen them capture them. You know how valuable those boys were. If I hadn't killed them, the Northerners would think me weak. Cause he's not, I'm telling you now, he's not killed them. There's no way he's killed them. We've not seen the girl. We've not seen um, a character name Argo, or Argo or something. Her name is. I'm not sure. And we've not seen Hodor. Hodor. I've come to bring you home. Father wants a word. Is this a joke? We're islanders, baby brother. Had you forgotten that? And now that you've decorated your walls with the bodies of the Stark boys, every man in the North wants to see you hanged. And I live up north, and I definitely agree. I'm a man of the north. Oh my god, that's such a sleigh. Man of the north. Oh yeah. When Rob Stark finds out. You won't find out. We've killed all the ravens. I will keep Winterfell. Oh, well, you know, we'll see about that. God, when Rob, when Rob gets word that apparently the, his brothers are dead, oh, he's going to be mad. You were a terrible baby, do you know that? And one night you just wouldn't shut up, screaming like a dying pig. <laughs> I wanted to strangle you. And you looked up at me and you stopped screaming. You smiled at me. Damn it. I'm joking, I'm joking, I'm joking. Don't kill babies. Don't die so far from the sea. And then he fucking touched her bits. So, who knows what to make of all that? <laughs> when you didn't come back, we weren't looking for you. But they found us before we found you. God, so he was never gonna get back to the group because they died and, I mean, he got captured. Your Grace, my lady, the Kingslayer. He escaped in the night. Wait, what? Wait, what? He's escaped again? How? Dooba, dooba, dooba. No. She said your sword to Brienne. Why? For the girls. She let him go? Are you stupid? Are you stupid? Yes, you're stupid. You're touched, bitch, okay? I have five children and only one of them is free. Kathleen, that, that was a rough decision, that was. Jamie Lannister. He's played you for a fool. Yeah, he has. You've weakened our position. You really have, because he's a good fighter. Make sure she's guarded day and night. Rob. Catelyn, you fucked it. Catelyn, you fucked it. Why would you just give him back? <laughs> like, without a trade, that's not happening. It's a long way to King's Landing. Might as well get to know one another. Is she escorting him all the way back to King's Landing? Has anyone ever told you you're as boring as you are ugly? She's not ugly. Why are we trying to sell this whole story that she's ugly? There are three men in the kingdoms who might have a chance against me. You're not one of them. You've not seen her fight, darling. She knows what she's doing. Maybe one day we'll find out, Kingslayer. I'm on my way from misery to happiness to be. But what's to stop the Lannisters from hurting Brienne when she gets there? I don't like it. A king who runs will not be king for long. He's a Lannister. He'll stand and fight. Joffrey stand and fight? <laughs> <laughs> oh, I can't wait to see that. We'll ride at nightfall. Where to? I want a full night's march before he knows we're on the move. The girl's proven herself a good servant. She'll stay on with you. So is he now riding to Rob? To battle? Or to Stannis? Oh no, Stannis is going for the Queen and Joffrey, right? And then when you're finished, sprinkle him over the pie crust. Where's Jacket? How would I know? We need someone killed. <laughs> We've missed this chance now, they've gone. One brother inside his army be worth a thousand fighting against him. They'll never trust me. They might. If you do what needs to be done. Fast then! We're acting! We're acting! We're putting on a performance to earn fake trust, I assume. Oh, we found something. Wait a minute. I was just about to say why we're digging. But we found something, something metal. It's been here a long time. What's it got inside it, though? Oh my God, what is that? Must be dragon glass. 
Dragon glass. I feel that's going to be Heidi. Uh, Handy. Heidi. That's going to be Heidi. Where were you? A man has patrolled you. How long after I give you the name does it take you to kill someone? A minute. An hour. A month. I mean, well, she can't necessarily say Tywin. I don't know if it's, it's got that, that kind of a reach. Give a name. Any name. Jack and Hagar. Who's that? Hagar hey gives a man his own name. Oh, it's him. <laughs> unname me. No. Please. I'll unname you. Thank you. If you help me and my friends escape. Deal. Or no deal. The girl and her friends will walk through the gate at midnight. So he's helping them escape. Lovely news. He's very good, isn't he? I'm glad he's on our side because he is very talented. He'll have his king's guard protecting him. He needs to be out there. The men will fight more fiercely seeing their king fighting beside them. And if Joffrey wants to go, let the boy go. <laughs> I'm into that. Why are you smiling? Because I'm happy. Why are you happy? Because I have your little whore. Huh? Tell me, have you married this one yet? She's got Shay. No. Pretty thing, your whore. Stop calling her a whore. You're a whore. Don't worry, she'll be treated gently enough. Unless Joffrey is hurt, and then every wound he suffers, she'll suffer too. And if he dies, there isn't a man alive who could devise a more painful death for your little... Why are we calling her such vile names? She's done nothing to you. Shut up. Sir Mandon, bring in my brother's whore. Oh, for God's sake, we're gonna see her. I hate how disgusting they... Like, like the disgusting names that they choose for people. When they've realistically done nothing. Oh, that's not our whore. That's not our whore. But I feel bad for her, because she's not his whore. Don't forget me. She's playing along. Why is she playing along? Oh, I love that she thinks she's best at him. That is so cute. Aw, oh, Cersei, you got the wrong whore. Look at her, she's so smug. <laughs> I love it, that's so funny. Shay! I've been waiting all night. I feel like we have to send her away for her own good now. Because this is too close, it's too close. It's, uh, we don't need it happening. We have to be more careful. Not, not just more careful. He knows now that Cersei is like gunning for, gunning for him. I wouldn't, I wouldn't even risk it. I'd send her away. It's for her own good. You're mine. Oh, bless I'm him. yours. And you're mine. Oh, God, I like them together. I, I, guys, I really hope she doesn't get killed, but I've got a feeling she's going to. How are you? Oh. Been better. I'm in the middle of a war. Right. Can't the latest he is so pretty, and I mean, so is she. So they'd, they'd be they'd, they'd be great together, but oh. When I was 12, my mother and father went to a wedding and they left me with my little brother. We couldn't bear to be inside, so we ran down to the Vroin. Every child in Volantis was in the Vroin that day. Volantis, that's a lovely name. I'd love to live in Volantis. It's like Atlantis. Oh, I need to watch that. I haven't watched that movie in ages. Atlantis. I was treading water, talking to a friend, when I realised I hadn't seen my brother. Brother dies, I'm assuming, right? And then I saw him. Floating? Floating dead? Floating face down. There it is. A man ran over, and he started pressing on my brother's chest. Did he save her brother? Because this will be a... Until my brother spat out half of the roid and cried out and the man cradled his head and told him to be calm. He wait, he saved her bro brother. So the reason why she now cares for people is because she didn't know how to care for her brother in that moment. Okay. I would not waste my years planning dances and masquerades with the other noble ladies. The end. That was a lovely story. Thank you so much, darling. I don't want to marry the Frey girl. He wants to marry you to Lisa. I don't want you to marry her. But you needed that bridge. Who, who cares about a bridge? I hope it's a very beautiful bridge. 
I hope it's a very beautiful bridge. <laughs> oh, good for them. Well done, guys. I love when two really attractive people kiss. Doesn't make me jealous at all. <laughs> Whoa. What do he wants to do about those guards? He didn't say anything about the guards. We have to trust him. Yeah, he'll kill them as you walk through, for sure. I want to go back to the kitchens. Shut up. Shut up. <laughs> yeah, already dead, look. Already dead. Already dead. Escaped. Piss easy. Woohoo! For the farmer. For his trouble. That's suspicious. She's fucking there. He knows they're not alive. What? I mean, he knows that they're not dead. I'm, I'm telling you, they're, they're not dead. For sure, for sure, for sure, for sure, for sure. Because why are we paying off a farmer? What's he done? Got as far as the farm, then doubled back. Walked through the stream to throw off the hounds. Hope this would be the last place they'd think to look. Are they hiding down the bottom? Who was that out there? Hung up at the gates. Must have been the farmer's boys. Oh my god, they killed the farmer's boys and that's why they're paying off the farmer. And passed them off as little lots. They mustn't know. They'll never hear it from me. He's alive. I mean, he's alive, but he's also awake. I mean, he's hearing it. Well, at least they're alive. Right? That's a good way to end, actually. That, I'm, I'm not too too mad at that. Because at least I know that they're alive. I, I'd have been pissed off if I'd, if I'd have had to finish today and not have known. But I, because I knew it. I, unless we see them die, they're not going to be dead. Because that's not how this show's going to work. Like, they're not just going to, like, two of the two of the Stark's children, do you really think they're going to just kill them off and not show us them getting burned? I don't think so. They're going to want the impact. Do you know what I mean? So, thinking logically, okay, um, so I'm not shocked that they're alive, but I can't believe they actually killed the farmer's boys and that's why they were going to pay him off. That's fucking crazy. And I love that they circled back. That's so smart. They circled back and then are hiding below. because Yeah, because they're not going to think to check their own crypts, I guess, because I think that's where they are, the crypts. So uh, they just need to be careful, I suppose, like going going up and down to get food and whatnot. But hopefully we can last until someone comes to take Winterfell back. I don't know. But anyway, great episodes. Not too gory, thank fuck. Um, I'm going to be very intrigued to see how this whole Jamie, thing's, th Jamie thing pans out. Um, and what happens when he's back there. Catelyn really fucked up and dropped the ball there, in my opinion. But yeah, with all that said, um, I'll be seeing you all soon with another video, I'm sure. I'm not sure when you'll be getting the last two episodes of the season, because like I said, I am going to be dog sitting. But it'll be as soon as I can. All right, love yous. See ya. Bye.